Hey guys, it's Chris here at Engine. In this week's video, we'll be giving you guys a quick overview of all the new features included in our new user and tag management system. Updates include a huge visual overhaul as well as additional functionality and actions to help manage your user base. The new system is still included in the user section of your admin panel, but you may notice a few additional tabs when visiting. Firstly, we'll have a quick look at the user manager. As you may notice, the section has had some visual updates, as well as a new Create Tag button and two drop-down menus for managing users and tags. Included also is an enhanced search function, allowing you to search using more detailed criteria. On the left side of the screen you'll see listed all the default and custom tags. Hovering your mouse over a tag category will allow you to create a new tag, while hovering your mouse over a tag will bring up a small edit button. You may also notice four new default tag groups, including online on site, online in TeamSpeak, warned users and punished users. Below the main tag categories we can see any custom created tags. Here we'll show you one of our new features which we think you'll really love, Engine's new drag and drop tag function. Simply hover over the tag you want and click and hold until you see the little cross icon. And then just drag and drop to a user in your member list. You should then see a box with some expiry options. Enter the options you want and then press add tag to user. Another new feature which we think you'll find really useful is the ability to assign users multiple tags at the same time. To do this, check the user in question and then hit the Bulk Actions drop-down menu. From the menu, you'll want to select the first option, Add Multiple Tags. You'll then see a box with a list of all the custom tags on your website. Choose the tags you want and then hit Add Tags at the bottom. Once again, enter your expiry options and then hit Add Tags to User. Another new feature we've added is a convenient Edit User drop-down menu to the right of each user. This menu provides a variety of options which make it far easier for you to manage your user base. We've also expanded on many of the features available. For example, let's check out the User Details option. From the new screen we're presented with a far more detailed management tool set, including the ability to force usernames, signatures and avatars, as well as reset in likes and posts. Below the user details option we have a user tags option which allows you to conveniently manage all your user tags and details from one place. The third option is IP history option which will list information regarding the user's last known IP addresses. If we scroll back to the top you'll notice a new create tag option. This allows you to quickly create tags via the user manager. This option is also included in the Tag Manager section, so we'll cover it in a bit more detail later. The next section we'll take a quick look at will be the IP Band section. You'll see this tab next to the User Manager tab, but if you don't see it, don't worry. This tab will only appear if you've actually IP banned a user on your website. Within this section, you can view and search for currently banned IPs and the user profiles associated. You have the options to remove an IP ban or add an IP ban. Clicking the Ban IP button will now give you an option to ban a single IP, an IP range or a wider IP range. The next tab over will be the Deleted Users tab. Again, this tab will only appear if you've actually deleted users from your website. From here you can view information on your deleted users, including when the user was deleted, the IP which deleted the user and the ability to restore users to your website. The final tab contained within the user section is the registration settings tab. This has been moved from the admin settings section. The section includes website registration settings, as well as two brand new features available to Ultimate Plan customers. These features include the ability to send a customized private message or email to a user upon registration. Our second big update comes in the form of an enhanced tag manager system. This can be located next to the Users tab. This new section allows you to maintain and manage all website tags from one convenient location. From the main screen you'll see details on all your website tags, including tag name, number of users associated, any images associated, any tag syncs, and a preview of the actual tag. 
Towards the top, we can see two new buttons, Create Category or Create Tag. Let's have a quick look at the Create Tag option. From this new screen, you should find consolidated all the information you need regarding your tags, including tag details, tag colors and effects, micro tags, Minecraft rank sync options, and Minecraft command options. If you have a TeamSpeak server up and running, you'll also notice some TeamSpeak sync options. Back on the main screen, if we scroll down, you'll see any custom tags or categories, as well as the ability to rearrange them however you want using the little cross icon. If we scroll back to the top of the page, we'll be having a look at our final tab, the tag expiry section. From this new section, you'll see details on all tags of expiry dates set, including username, tag name, date added, expiry date, the ability to edit the tag, or the ability to untag the user. And that's it. We hope you've enjoyed this quick overview of the new user and tag manager system. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment, or you can send in a support form. All links included in the video description.